The latest episode of Vinland Saga, Season 2, Episode 14, opens with a nail-biting continuation of the previous episode's cliffhanger. The tension is palpable as Gardar confirms that Arnheid is the one he's been looking for, and it's all happening on Kettle's farm. As Arnheid stares at him in horror, Gardar can't help but comment on her beauty. Thorfinn and Einar watch from a distance, wondering if Gardar is Arnheid's husband. Gardar then starts asking about Halti, like a proud father would, confirming their suspicions. Arnheid's reaction is one of pure horror, and just when things couldn't get any worse, Snake shows up. He warns Arnheid not to take Garda's hand and draws his sword, promising to kill Garda if she does. Fox and Badger finally arrive to back Snake up, and just when Garda reaches for Arnheid's hand, Snake swings his sword and takes Garda down. As Garda lies on the ground, Snake asks Fox if he really killed Lizard, and Fox confirms to Arnheid's horror. But Snake remains calm, reminding Fox that Garda is here to kidnap Arnheid, and he needs to protect her with his life. Meanwhile, Einar can't contain his worry and grips his axe, ready to attack Snake. Thankfully, Thorfinn stops him, reminding him that they don't know what's going on, and he can't just attack Snake. Despite wanting Arnheid to be free, Thorfinn knows that three men would have to die for everyone to get away safely. Einar reluctantly agrees, but wonders what he's supposed to do instead. Snake congratulates Thorfinn's choice and orders them to watch quietly from the sidelines. He then approaches Gardar, saying he will capture him alive to question him and confirm his identity. Gardar attacks Snake, but the head mercenary masterfully dodges each of his moves without even drawing his own weapon. Badger warns Snake to be careful, but Snake scoffs and asks who he thinks he's talking to. Gardar charges again, and Snake dodges again before landing a blow with the back of his blade that sends Gardar to the ground. Snake knocks Gardar unconscious with the back of his sword and orders Badger to tie him up. Fox congratulates Snake, while Arnheid continues calling his name, and Thorfinn and Einar look on with worry. Snake warns Fox not to let his guard down and tells him to inform Kjallika's uncle that they've apprehended the murder suspect. As Snake walks away, he turns to Einar and Thorfinn, commenting on how they look like they have something to say. He then hilariously adds that a slave's opinion doesn't matter and continues walking. Einar asks if they can let Gardar off the hook, but Snake reminds them that he has killed one of his own men and is suspected of killing others. He adds that since he wants to kill Kettle and kidnap Arnheid, their hands are tied. The episode then shows Arnheid crying behind a building, with Snake telling her to forget about Gardar. He reveals that Gardar isn't her husband, but a runaway slave who lost his mind. He warns them all to stay out of this matter and asks them to look after Sverkel for him as he departs. The scene then changes to later that day, Einar, Thorfinn, and Arnheid sitting in Sverkel's house, brooding in silence. Suddenly, Einar jumps up, ready to save Gardar, but Thorfinn and Arnheid urge him to wait. After all, dinner is almost ready, and nobody wants to miss a good meal. Arnheid explains that sometimes, things can't be changed, but Einar won't listen. He insists that they have to act now, or Gardar will die. Desperate for help, he turns to Thorfinn, but even he remains silent. Just when things are about to get heated, Arnheid interrupts Einar by sharing her own heartbreaking story. We travel back in time to a peaceful village in Sweden, where Arnheid and Garda's family lived a happy life. But then, Ion was discovered in a distant forest, sparking a vicious fight for ownership. Despite the women's objections, the men of the village decided to join the fight, hoping to capitalize on the potential financial benefits. Arnheid begged Garda to reconsider, but he was convinced that this was the only way to secure a better future for their family. The men left, leaving the women and children behind to defend their homes. But when enemy forces attacked the village, the men were nowhere to be found. Arnheid lost her son to the invaders, and her world was shattered forever. Back in the present, Arnheid reveals that she is pregnant with Kettle's baby, and she's afraid of what the stormy world of men will bring to her child. Sverkel shares his own painful story of love and loss, and the episode ends with Arnheid leaving to be by Garda's side. Vinland Saga Season 2, Episode 14, is a poignant and emotional journey that will leave you feeling both heartbroken and hopeful. The backstory and lore add depth and complexity to the characters, making them more relatable and human. Don't miss this powerful episode that reminds us of the scars that storms leave behind. Thanks for watching, drop a comment below and let us know what you thought of the episode. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more.